Welcome back to the channel YouTube. Today we have something a little different for you than we normally bring to the channel. We have the 2023 Valiant official team trading cards for the University of Michigan's 2023 football team. This is a product that was released in a pack only format. Uh, you can purchase it at MDEM. They, if you're familiar with Michigan at all, they are uh, one of the biggest retailers of Michigan products. And if you're a Michigan fan, you're probably already aware of them. But these are NIL, uh, an NIL featured product, right? So these directly go to the funding of the NIL for the players. So supporting Michigan student athletes. They did this product last year, sold it in individual packs and in a full team set. This year, they only have the packs released so far. Uh, I'm sure they'll do a team set as well. They did the same thing for the men's basketball team. They've changed up the product a little bit this year. So last year they released a set and have a couple here to look at. So um, they would have, this was what the base card looked like. So fully licensed University of Michigan uh, on, on the product. And they did, uh, it gives you a lot of information about the player on the back, but they also had variants for some of the players. So like here are both the JJ McCarthy cards that were in last year's set. And then the previous quarterback, who's now at the University of Iowa, um, had some different variations. And you can see these are usually game shots. So that's the other nice thing about it. They're not really practice shots or anything like that, um, including autographs that you can get in this set. So last year they didn't have, uh, they had base cards and they had autographs like this. So I'll just uh, set these off to the side for a second. This year's product is a little bit different. Every pack contains 10 cards, nine base cards, and one insert. Now, out of the inserts, there are three different types that you can get. So there's the autographs again, um, and that's a bigger number of uh, players that autograph this year. I think it's actually 30 players. There are 10 helmet sticker cards, uh, which look like the helmet stickers that go on to the University of Michigan helmets during the games. And then 16 legend cards, including players like Mike Hart and current coach Jim Harbaugh. So there's a um, total of 110 cards in the set, plus the inserts. So uh, roughly uh, 166 cards, I think, total. Um, these do cost $20 a pack at the site. I haven't seen anybody uh, selling them on the secondary market, but they're still available on the MDEN site if you want to go get them. But we're going to take a look and start ripping into what these look like this year. So it'll be interesting to see, since this is a collegiate product, how um, something like this will do on the secondary market later. Obviously, it's going to be a valuable thing to Michigan collectors, but for the general sports market, maybe not the most interesting product. So base card looks obviously a little different this year. Just a quick comparison. I put the Valiant logo in the upper right hand corner instead of the Michigan logo. Redesign the cards a little bit. And there are players that have, again, multiple cards in it. So some of the key guys like J.J. McCarthy, Blake Corum, Donovan Edwards, Junior Colston will have more than one base card in the set. Uh, they are a paper stock, so they're not chromium or anything of that nature. So um, they, are, they are kind of a lighter product. I think we've got, yeah, this is a helmet sticker. So this is what the helmet sticker insert looks like, and it's literally a sticker you can take off. So each of these is numbered after a specific game or event. So just to give an example, um, some of the ones that are on here uh, cover things like the first game Michigan ever played, the first Rose Bowl, the first time Bo beat Woody, uh, the last two where um, we beat OSU in the regular season, Obviously, I'll, I'll say we, I'm a Michigan fan, uh, if that hasn't been clear in previous videos. This one in particular is the uh, Wanger to Carter from the Michigan 27, Indiana 21 game in 1979. So you have to be a little bit of a historian to, to know that. And there's some unusual dust on this, but that's the first of the inserts. And there's one of the key guys you're looking for, Donovan Edwards. Zach Zenner, Roman Wilson. William Wagner, and there's a J.J. McCarthy. So 
it's interesting to see how NIL is coming out, uh, has kind of sparked some interesting university specific sets. I've seen some other products out there, uh, some specific sets from even like Panini uh, for some of the universities. So it's kind of neat to see that some of this stuff is going um, so directly to the students. We've got a, looks like the other one of JJ McCarthy. So there's the two base cards for him right away. And then here we've got a Blake Corum autograph. And this, however, is chrome stock. It's a much thicker card. It is a sticker autograph. So it's worth pointing that out. But we're going to sleeve this one up real quick. Oh, not a different sleeve. That one doesn't want to cooperate. Oh, I'll just stick it there for a moment. But these do, for the price, honestly, we're going to see. It'll be interesting. We got 10 packs to look at. Um, I'm curious to see how many autographs we're actually going to pull in that number of packs. Because this could be a um, pretty high value product, honestly, if there's um, if autographs are frequent. Um, I haven't been able to find out exactly how likely you are to pull them. They do only come in this pack format. They don't. Um, they don't release them in like blasters or hobby boxes. Well, and there's our second auto, Roman Wilson. So pretty awesome start for the autographs. That's uh, two of the key starting players on the offense. And let's see CJ Stokes. Micah Pollard and Davis Warren, one of the backup quarterbacks. Now, last year I opened probably, uh, I want to say somewhere between 30 and 40 packs of this. And I only pulled one autograph. So this year, three packs in, two autographs. Already feels like a much better product. There's the JJ again. Here's another sticker, this one of 988. This is the most recent one over Ohio State last year. Keon Sab, who should have a higher role, the mutant, Chris Jenkins. All right. But again, getting back to what I was saying before, uh, it'll be interesting to see how the market reacts to some of this NIL sponsored content that's becoming more and more common uh, since you know college doesn't tend to be as popular in the card community as uh, professional is but for some people like myself who who do love collecting some of the college products uh, it's awesome this is the game where Bo upset Woody for the first time so it was 19 the 1969 Michigan Ohio State game where Michigan won 24 to 12 Pretty famous game. Mike Sam was still one of the team captains and amazing defender. So tell me what you think in the comments, uh, not only of this product, but uh, the college type products in general. You know, uh, are there teams you're looking for? Are there sets you'd like to see produced? I'm curious to see any of the bigger companies catch on to doing this instead of uh, like this is being done by Valiant, which is one of the NIL groups that's Michigan's work working with. Uh, this is from the Braylon Fest game. So this is a Michigan, Michigan State game where Braylon Edwards went absolutely wild. If you ever look up highlights of that game if you didn't see it. Will Johnson, one of the best cornerbacks in the entire sport this year. On pace to be a first round NFL draft pick. It'll be interesting to see how much the hobby pays attention to these cards as far as if they get considered like rookies or how they get classified. Um, if, if collectors are going to start looking at their uh, these college sets that come out as if they're not worth anything or if they actually are looked at like the first cards of the players. And there is one of the legend inserts. 
So that's Mike Hart. Current running back coach. It's a nice looking insert. That insert is still on the uh, paper stock, so not like the autographs, which are on the nicer card stock. Looks like we got another auto on this one. There's the one of the Blake Corn base cards. And who is it? Michael Barrett. Team captain, linebacker. Nice looking card. So we'll throw, no offense, Mike, but we're going to put you behind Roman here. Mirror hearing. Greg Tar, Ernest Hausman. So they even have, um, you know, they even got the newer players that transferred in, some of the freshmen in here. So they, these are some of the players' first cards that have been produced. I know there were some key players last year, um, like Will Johnson, that his cards in the set went for a little bit of a premium because a lot of Michigan collectors were treating that as his rookie. There's Junior Colston. There's Win 975, which is the Previous win where Michigan beat Ohio State two years ago in the snow um, that they continuously cried they didn't know how to play in. Apologies to any uh, Ohio State fans that are watching. Feel free to downvote, but uh, facts are facts. And our last pack here. like another JJ McCarthy on the back and another autograph. So um, three out of our, or four out of our 10 packs. Sorry. We got Donovan Edwards again, Zach Zinner, top offensive lineman. Another JJ. And oops, that wasn't the last card. Let's see if we can sweat this one out a little bit. Um, what was the position out on these? Show. Oh, it's underneath there. Not gonna really be able to sneak it, so. Akari Page. Defensive back. Or safety. Likely a starting, uh, rumor is, anyway, he's, um, potentially one of our starting safeties this year. So, honestly, can't complain about that. Only one of the Legends inserts, but four autographs. Um, Blake Corum, Makari Page, Roman Wilson, Michael Barrett. Two offensive players, two defensive players. These are, these autograph cards are really high quality. So um, definitely compare, comparable to higher end premium, um, Topps Chrome stock, some of the stuff we see in the soccer products from like Italy. So, and then just looking through our uh, other inserts real quick, we got a bunch of the stickers. The Mike Hart as the legend and five stickers. I don't know if that's an accurate distribution of how these work going. Uh, if you're going to end up purchasing some as far as how often you get the inserts, but honestly, five stickers, four autographs and one legend card. Uh, not something I would complain about at all. Pretty happy with it. So anyway, uh, as a quick reminder, there's still going to be some time. We have a uh, giveaway that we are doing. Typically, we rip a lot of soccer on this channel, so we are doing a giveaway of these Merlin Blasters. So there are there's information in the description of the video. But basically, if you like and subscribe to our channel, uh, ring that notification bell so you can see when new videos get uploaded. But for every 100 subscribers we have by Labor Day, this coming Monday, uh, there'll be a drawing to give away one of these Blasters, which are pretty hot soccer products. So if you're interested in soccer cards at all, Give us a like, subscribe. There's other ways to enter. Information will be in the description. Thanks for watching.